This video shows how I prepared and repainted the frame and fork of my 49-year-old Schwinn Collegiate. Hello, this is Ed. Welcome to my channel. This is part 7 of my Restoring the Rusty Blue Schwinn Bike Series. I started by dry sanding but switched to wet sanding to find it a bit more effective. Now this sticker is something you don't see very often. Then I removed the labels using my wife's hair dryer. In preparation for painting, I wiped the frame and fork with alcohol and set them on a stand in my backyard. Next I applied a primer to cover any bare spots that had been exposed by my sanding or due to corrosion. It never fails. The moment I start painting, it always seems the wind kicks up. I'm not the best painter, and I have a tendency to leave too many sags and drips that I'll show through on the finished coat, so I have to wind up wet sanding the frame and fork to make it appear better. When the air temperature is near the lower limit for painting, according to the manufacturer's recommendation, I usually take the can and run it under some warm water, not hot water, but warm water to loosen things up. I've had bad experiences where I haven't done this before. After applying the final coat of paint, I painted the kickstand silver and applied the badge to the front head. I hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.